hi guys and welcome back to my channel so for today's video as i said in my last video last time that i wanted to do like a prom uh, makeup look because obviously it's almost june and that's like um the month that would the prom happens and stuff like that so i thought like i'll create a prom look for like anybody that's in the 11 or 6 form and they're having the prom and they're looking for a certain look to do so that's what i'm gonna do today and um i can't remember the last time I used a pink eyeshadow so I thought I'll do a pink um a pink look today and hopefully it turns out good but yeah I'm going to use glitter as well because obviously it's pump like you need glitter like you don't need to but if you're extra like me you need glitter but yeah I think that's what we're going to do today I'm gonna do a prom look today and you guys are so lucky like you guys are lucky prom is in 2019 because when I went to prom let's not talk about it <laughs> i wish i could go to prom again so i can like recreate everything because back then i didn't know how to do well i did know how to do my makeup but it wasn't like as good as it is right now and my sister did my makeup anyway like we both were trying to do makeup so boy yeah you guys are lucky you have all the products that you need you have a lot of youtube videos to watch and yeah so yeah let's just get started because i don't want this video to be long so First, we are going to start with the Makeup Revolution Court Chris ca Canvas. I'm going to put that all over my eyelids, just so um, all the colors that we put on it pops, basically. And I'm hoping I'm close enough, cause I got a comment on my um, what do you call it? My Tammy review. One lady was like. Could you possibly like zoom in so we can see the eye looks better? So I listened and hopefully this is close enough. Oh, and you guys can see me and I hope the ring light is helping as well. Please guys, tell me that you can see the difference. Because if, if you just tell me my thing looks exactly the same then I just wasted my money. But I bought this ring light and I'm so happy with it. Like, I'm so excited about I hope. It made the quality a bit better and now i can even like record at night because like usually i was depending on like sunlight i was depending on, depending on daylight but the fact that i have this ring light now that means like i can record at night even if i don't have time to record like during the day so yeah so i'm just um taking a fluffy, uh, fluffy brush and i'm going to buff this all over my eyelids Okay, now that's done. We're not going to set it because the color pops more when the thing is wet. So we are going to use the Tammy uh, Makeup Revolution Tropical Carnival Eyeshadow Palette because it has some pinks in it. So yeah. So we are going to use um, these two colors. Like that looks purple, but when you swatch it, it's a bit pink. So yeah. Um. So I just grab like a fluffy brush and I'm going to, um, well I'm going to start with this one because it's a bit darker. It's called Mass. Yeah, we're going to take Mass and then I'm just going to pat that on our lid. Not all the way to the eyebrow, it's just like right there. Oh gosh, she actually looks purple in real life. Well, that's dead. Okay. Just gonna wipe my brush so I can dig into the other color. Now we're gonna take the lighter pink which is called pink panther so dab into that just put that above that dark pink well it's not even dark pink it's just purple okay 
one guy i think that's blended so now what we are going to do is we are going to cut our crease if i can find the brush yeah using the same um uh, cut crease canvas i'm going to use that to cut my crease i just put a little bit on your hand and then just use a tiny eyeshadow brush to do this I think I'm gonna go back with the purple, dark pink, and then put that just on the outer V. Okay, I think that will do. No, it's glitter time. Right, I'm gonna take the NYX glitter primer. And then we're just going to pop that where we cut the crease pretty much. This is the glitter that I'm gonna use. It's so pretty. It's like it's like purplish pink. Pretty, pretty. I like glitter so much. Even it gets messy, but who cares? I just pack that on and delete. I'm happy with that okay now if you want to add eye, um, eyeliner you can but can't be bothered and I'm not really into eyeliner like that so I'm gonna skip that step and if I wanted to do eyeliner I would have done it before I put the glitter because trying to draw eyeliner on top of glitter is a mission so I'm going to pop on my eyelashes guys and then I'll be right back. Alright guys, so my eyelashes are done and I've just primed my face with my Milk of Magnesia. And if you're going to prom, make sure you prime unless you're planning on sitting down the whole night. So if you're going to dance and do all that and have fun, put primer or I should make which is going to melt and you don't want that. So yeah, I use the Milk of Magnesia because that's the only thing that works for me because I'm very oily and it helps with the sweating too. So right now we are going to move straight into foundation and i'm going to use my la girl pro coverage high definition long way illuminating foundation and i'm going to use my kabuki brush to apply it okay i think that's blended enough gonna move on to concealer and I'm going to use the LA Girl Pro in Fawn 
I'm just gonna put this on all the places that I usually highlight. Right, taking your damp um, beauty blender, whatever sponge you have, and just blend everything. Oh, um, my foundation was in the shade coffee, by the way. Yeah, coffee. Forgot to mention that. Okay, now you want, what you want to do is flip over your beauty sponge so you get the flat side and then blend these harsh lines because you don't want it to be seen. Okay, and now I'm going to take my setting powder to set like all these places that I highlighted and this is the black opal powder in the shade medium but what i did is i mixed it with my fenty in the shade honey because i felt like it was too the, the fenty one was too light for me because i just didn't like how it was looking on my face like it looks a bit ashy and i was like well i spent a lot of money on that fenty so i'm not gonna get rid of it so i just bought this and then i thought i'll mix it together and the mixture actually works so i'm glad i did that but yeah we're just gonna use this powder to set on the eye okay now to set the rest of my face i'm going to use the same black cocoa powder but this is in dark where's my powder brush i'm just gonna use my powder brush to do this obviously what else would you use girl and make sure you get your eyebrow because you don't want shiny eyebrows Alright, now we are going to contour my favourite part. I'm going to take my Primark um, foundation powder, but I use it as a contour because it's pretty dark. It's in the shade Rich Espresso and it looks like this. Take a little bit. Going back with my powder brush, I'm going to get rid of this excess powder on my face okay now what we are going to do is shall I spray my face first then do blush right we are going to spray the face actually no what we are going to do is do the lower lash so i want to use i'm gonna take this the darker pink Okay, that will do. Oh, I got some eye in my eye. Okay, and now we're going to spray our face. 
this is the primark setting spray but the bottle was not functioning properly so i just put in a random container Okay, so now we're going to blush and I'm going to use the Saharan Blush Palette by Driven's Place. I feel like I'm going to use pink because my eyes are pink, but at the same time, you know, I'm going to mix. Mm, yeah, I'm going to mix this too because why not? Okay, so now we are going to highlight and I'm going to take my Colourpop Cream Highlighter. This is a champagne goldish colour. I'm going to put this in my inner tear duct. And then I need my fan brush. So taking a fan brush and I dig into that same highlighter and put this on my cheeks. Okay. Now what I'm going to do is go on top of that with the Makeup Revolution Vivid Baked Bronzer in the shade Rock and Wild. Just take a little bit of that and just put it on top. Okay. Now what you want to do is go back with your blush brush and just blend that into your skin so it's not just sitting on top okay we are getting there right now shall we do yeah i'm gonna do my bottom lashes Okay, so now we're going to do lips and I'm going to align it with this dark brown lip pencil. Okay, and because like our eyes are psh, right there in the face, we're gonna keep the lips nice and simple. So I'm just gonna take this primer clip glass in the shade Nude Ambition, and then we're just gonna put it on our lips. I hope it's not too pink, like pale pink. Alright guys, I think this is the final look. What do you guys think? I think it looks so cute. I'm not even I'm not even going nowhere. Like this is all this is all a waste. I just wasted my makeup for you guys. I wasted foundation for you guys. 
Where am I going? What do you guys think? Do you like it? So if you're going to prom then you are looking for something, I think this is cute. Especially if your dress is like pinkish purple. Yeah, this is definitely like a look you can have. Oh, and that highlight is pop. Oh my God. Guys, prima highlight. And thank you guys very much for watching and I hope you are subscribed and you have hit the notification bell as well. So you get notified when I upload next because as I said, I have a lot, a lot, a lot more exciting videos coming your way. So make sure you're subscribed, share this. If you have a cousin, a sibling, I don't know, anybody that's going to prom or even a wedding and they're looking for a look, then share the video, then they have something to follow in it. But yeah, if you're going to prom, make sure you have a good time because you just finished your 11 g This is a stress. So have a good time. Enjoy yourself. But yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.